we're going to play around with integers and the number line. Let's look at some distances and numbers on the number line. If I ask you to start at zero and go up by three steps, where do you end up? One, two, three, you end up over here, three, which is the number three on the number line. So starting at zero and walking up three steps ends you up at number three on the number line. If you start at zero and walk down two steps, you end up over here, and that is negative two on the number line. So if you started at zero and you went up four steps, you'd end up at four on the number line. If you started at zero and went down five steps, you would end up over here at negative five on the number line. If you start at two on the number line and go down two steps, you'll end up at zero. If you start at negative three on the number line and go up three steps, you'll end at zero. So how far is it from three to minus two? Well, we can go and count one, two, three, four, five steps, but also we could be a bit smarter and say, look at what we've been using already up until now and see that from three to zero, that's three steps. And from zero to negative two, that's two steps. And so in total, it is five steps from three to negative two on the number line. Try this one for yourself. How far is it from four to negative three? Pause the video and try it yourself. Okay, so four would be about here on the number line and negative three, negatives are below the zero, negative three would be around there. And then we can straight away use the idea that from four down to zero is four steps and from zero down to negative three is three steps. So we've gone four steps and three steps. And so in total, we have gone seven steps. The question now can be used for much bigger numbers. So how many steps are there from negative 22 to 31? Well, 31, I mean, now this number line has got no markings on it. So I'm just going to make a sort of say, OK, look, if you know, 31 definitely has to be above the zero, right? And it's over there. And if I put that over there, negative 22, well, that's got to be below the zero and not quite as far below as that 31 is. So it'll be as the 31 is above. So negative 22 will be around there. But the idea I can use is the same one I've used before, which is that where is 31? It's 31 steps above the zero. And where is 22? Negative 22. Negative 22 is 22 steps below the zero. So to go from negative 22 up to 31, we can do 22 steps to get to zero and then 31 steps to get to 31. And so in total, we've got 22 plus 31 steps, which is going to be 53 steps.